Hey guys, I'm at Mid Hope Castle. If you're an Outlander fan like me, you might recognize this place as Lallybrock. Um, this is Jamie Fraser's home in Outlander. And this is the filming location for all the outdoor scenes um, from Lallybrock. So this is pretty awesome to be here. They are currently filming season seven right now. Um, and it will be closed actually in the coming days. So I had to come before it closed. It's beautiful and it's a sunny day. It's awesome. As you can see, there will be doing filming in the coming weeks. So there is trailers over there and they put fences, of course, to restrict the area. But yeah, this is pretty cool still. We can see the front of the castle. It's, there is not much to see apart from um, the front porch, etc. There is nothing in here, but for the exterior shots, that's what they use for um, Lallybrock. to this first vlog ever. Uh, I'm in Scotland right now in Edinburgh and this is gonna be awesome so I'm taking you with me on this journey. Um, this is actually my second day here. Uh, I'm a rookie doing this so I'm already messing this up. So second day here in Edinburgh and you may be able to see it behind me it's Victoria Street um, so we're gonna get uh, headed there and yeah it's awesome uh, very lovely town it's quite special today because, um, as you know, the Queen passed away two days ago, Queen Elizabeth. So they're doing all sorts of preparation right now um, to welcome her in the town. So we're going to go to the Royal Mai next and it's going to be very crowded and very busy, I think. But yeah, let's go. Okay, so we're on the rail mile right now and it's packed, like it's very crowded of course. We're all expecting the, the Queen's last uh, homage in Edinburgh and then uh, she's gonna go to the cortege, she's gonna go to St. Giles Cathedral. But right now the rail mile is crazy crowded. Kind of surreal to be here on this weekend.
Okay guys, I'm now in Carfax Close, which you may recognize as a filming location for Outlander Season 3. This is uh, Jamie's print shop, so Alexander Malcolm's print shop, I, st I should say. So this is pretty iconic for Outlander fans. This is where Claire walks the steps um, to reunite with Jamie after two decades. So it's a very important scene and it's a pretty cool place. As you can see, it was used for um, an Outlander female filming locations. So this is Carfax Close. The iconic stairs that Claire's walks on, just like I'm doing right now. Of course, there is no printing uh, shop here for real. Uh, there is nothing. It was just used for outdoor shots. But this is the exact um, street. And here you can recognize the entrance of the tunnel. So second day, full day in Edinburgh and I've got to say, the architecture in this city is so beautiful. Uh, we're on Victoria Street again and I think right now we're heading to a pub or something. I want to taste some haggis, I've never had it and it looks delicious. So yeah, we'll see. We're at the restaurant, first time having haggis. It looks quite good. Let's see how it is. It's good.
Okay, so I'm now in Blackness Castle, which was used for for William in Outlander, and that's of course uh, where Jamie gets wiped by G Black Jack Randall in that gruesome scene. So this is the castle that was used, and it's pretty incredible to be um, here. Like it's like stepping onto the screen. So that's the exact same spot if you can recognize. Yeah. And so you can go and explore the castle, guys. You've got the tower here, which you can go up. You can do So the car and there's two houses here, which is where they had the blood. And this is where is. Jamie, the go yeah. Jamie's so ghost, he's on the at her. he's on the far side. So yeah. he see this building here. He's looking at the far away window. So see when you get there, hmm? there's a uh, two flower boxes in a window, and it's yeah. the far away one. Okay. Nice. nice. Thank you. Vulture. Hello and welcome to this special mini tour. It's Misha Sam Hewen. I'm Sam Hewen and I play Jamie Fraser, the dashing boy hero of the hit TV drama Alberta, based on the novel.
course is here. On a fait deux, non Je sais pas. Voilà. Avec...
Okay, I'm at Drummond Castle, hope I'm pronouncing that right, uh, which was used in Outlander to um, do Versailles. So of course uh, they didn't film it in France, they filmed it actually here in the Drummond Gardens. And maybe you can recognize the, the stairs over there. And this is a spot where Jamie meets Jack Randall again um, after season one and that uh, ending, yeah. So this is where Jamie faces Randall again and with the King of France, he's in that scene too. So it's this exact spot. So I'm at the University of Glasgow, which was also used in Outlander to create Harvard. So unfortunately, the scene that was uh, with Brian Roger was filmed in the cloisters over there, but it is unfortunately closed. So we can't see them right now, but still, the buildings are absolutely gorgeous. It kind of looks like Hogwarts too. I kind of want to study here, like, not gonna lie. So this is where the cloisters, the arches, are supposed to be, but unfortunately it's closed. But yeah, this is where was filmed um, the scene in Outlander uh, in our with Brianna and Roger. We're in Glasgow right now. The plan is to explore uh, other Outlander locations, including the Glasgow University. And of course, um, there's also a street where we can see the apartment of Brianna and her mother Claire, uh, supposedly in Boston. But of course, it all, it's all filmed here in Glasgow. Um, but it's Boston in the show.
okay, last day uh, in Edinburgh and in Scotland. And before taking the flight, we made a little stop at Starbucks. I'm uh, tasting the pumpkin spice latte for the first time and it's delicious. And we have a beautiful view on Cockburn Street over there. It's awesome. The atmosphere in the city right now is very different than on our first day because now it's much more quiet. Um, we're uh, Monday the 19th, so it's, everything is closed for the Queen's funeral uh, in London right now. Um, and so, yeah, it's very different than on the first day of the trip. But it's nice to be back in Edinburgh. Like, I love this city. It has a unique charm. Um, yeah, almost the end of the trip, but enjoying it until the last uh, hour. Cheers. Okay, it's time I think to close this vlog the way it started on beautiful Victory Street. Um, so it was an extraordinary trip for me. Uh, first time in Scotland, but definitely, definitely not the last. So yeah, I can't wait to come back as soon as possible. Bye guys!